Hey guys, Jesse Dietrich here. I just want to wish everybody happy holidays, happy new year. Thank you for watching my mindset tips throughout the past year. Uh, I want you, everybody to reflect on the past year, think about all the great things that have come to you this year, and also think about all the great things that 2016 has to offer for you. Here's a look back from mindset tips throughout 2015. Take a look, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. It's on. And you can do a lot more than you actually think you can do. So push today we're talking about how to get through the holidays. And if you write down three things that you're grateful for every single day, it actually changes your brain chemistry to think. Usually the smaller hockey players, they can anticipate two or three plays in advance. The question is, do you want it? Leads out there. And I'm talking about a few things that I would do differently if I was a young athlete again. And number one, pretty obvious I would go back and I would have trained appropriately so I want you to think about the big reason why you're in the gym more than well I want to lose a few pounds more than I just want to get healthy there's probably some me that 20% of what you do will count for 80% of the results that you're looking for really the only way that we can get better at this area of skill development is by listening to our coaches listening to our teammates letting go of things that you have no control over for think about the top reasons why they play sports uh, and the number one reason, obviously, for most kids is to have fun. Right, now this week, we're talking about persistence. And this week, I want to talk about work ethic. You have to be willing to change in order to obtain those goals and in order to uh, make the world a better place.